yeah well okay so this is toxic waste and well let's watch how toxic this toxic waste is Oh. Crunch. Ah, it's so toxic. It's so toxic. It's not like toxic, like in 40 years, you're going to get cancer. It's rapid. We're, we're talking about like five, 10 seconds. <laughs> Seriously. Ah. Not Ugh. appropriate for children. So, so that means the corporation that abandoned this factory, they put mm -hmm. this like hyper toxic stuff in this rusting container without secondary containment on the ground, just chilling for pretty much for the rest of time until something happens to it. I mean, gosh, I, I, I'm imagining that's a chain link fence out, out front and it's locked. So mm -hmm. nobody should be in there. And this, I mean, it's labeled, labeled toxic waste danger. I did. Hey, like, right. We did. If you are the corporation, you know, you did your part. Yeah. You put danger and you put toxic waste. And if there's seepage, the local community and any community downstream should come in here and take care of it. So it's not my responsibility. I mean, okay. 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 So you put a chain link fence around the facility and nobody mm -hmm. should be going inside. I mean, what, what, what do you want me to me, the corporation? What do you want me to do? Like evacuate, like, like the cities too? Like, like people got to live where they live. Yep. And then I label this thing, toxic waste and danger. Like, mm -hmm. Hey, this thing is dangerous because there's toxic waste inside. I'm not, I'm not planning for like, there might be criminal activity and like, there's like drive this ice cream truck mm -hmm. into it. Like what do, you, what do you want me to do? Put this in a bunker? Like, you know, and it's going to, if I was the corporation, it's going to cost me money to just dis properly dispose of these materials um and i'm out of here so it's really Sorry. not my problem anymore i'm looking out for the shareholders the shareholders are telling me you know if the if the community nearby is going to feel the pain from the toxic waste because it might seep into the ground or the the, the container breaks and it also mm -hmm. seeps into the ground i mean that's their responsibility to take care of as a, as that, a representative of the shareholder i'm not going to do that that's right. Easy. Right. I mean, I, I take care of my business. They take care of their business. Yeah. Is, is that what you're saying? Right? Yeah. Yeah. Same thing here. Like we, we, we dispose of these toxic, I don't know, chemicals and equipment and just throw it into, you know, this rainwater accumulator. So that it, I mean, I just don't, you know, I'm looking out for my shareholders. Okay. I, I like what you're saying. We're doing a goof, but this bothers me. <laughs> this bothers me a lot. Okay. Cause if there's toxic, if there is toxicity in there, mm -hmm. this is standing water. This mm -hmm. is, this is where mosquitoes are born. And you mm -hmm. I mean, what type of mutant weird mosquitoes might come out of this? And then they're flying in the air, buzzing around, not, not good. Mm -hmm. And this really needs to have good drainage because this water could, could affect this tank. And like rust it out yep. from the bottom. If you rust it out from the bottom, now the water is going to like leak yep. or whatever toxic waste. Yep. Going to leak into the ground, into like the water table, maybe hit on aquifer. So you get this like mm -hmm. running water underground. Mm -hmm. And then this toxic waste could be pulled to other communities that are far away. So so I think as me, as a shareholder representative, okay. I need to get a couple of geologists on it and make sure they map out the entire aquifer. Okay. And so when this toxic water seeps down into the aquifer we need to make sure that our neighborhoods are far away from the seepage so that other communities will feel the pain of the toxins so i get okay okay, okay seriously i get okay. i don't get poisoned and my True. shareholders maximize profits because we don't have to pay for the cleanup like how's this not a win-win Yep, and and I guess it also makes sense from the employee perspective, like the executive perspective. You you actually pay a lot of money to the geological for the geological surveys, such that yeah. any toxicity, any bad stuff happens mm -hmm. far away from your employees. Because if employees are getting sick, they're yeah. not going to want to work for you. But if right. someone's getting sick, I don't know, two hundred miles away, like who's going to even connect the dots? Who's going to connect the dots? I just make sure my guys are not over there in that town. And if I, if I notify the town that there could be a problem, 
I, I may expose myself to potential problems. They're, they're so, going to be on to me. So I'm not going to notify them. But they should be smart enough. They're sophisticated members of society. They should know. They should do their own test. That this is a, they should do their own tests. Like they right. should pay and, for it. Right. I'm looking out for me. Sure. Why are they, they trusting me? They should independently get their own answer and then see if it agrees. Yeah. I'm under no obligation to inform people of the repercussions of my money saving operation. There's only one obligation, which is to do the shareholders. Sure. Yeah. Make I don't money. want to get poisoned. So I get, make sure to hire the geologists to make sure it won't come into my neighborhood and everything's golden. I mean, it's an externality. It's on the outside. Yeah. Other people pay for it. I don't need to pay for it. Yeah. Like this thing. Oh, I don't need to pay for decommissioning. Yeah. Absolutely not. I mean, if whatever company was here, they got bankrupt, they bounced. In fact, I even took a tax credit out because this was donated to the homeless. That's right. This could be, <laughs> there could be lots of homeless people living in here. Yeah, <laughs> but it's a charity write off. They also choose not to because this place is scary. I mean, hey, they're on drugs, not my problem. Toxic. So toxic. Look at the stride, though. Nice stride, yeah. It's good. Good running. Get out of there.